Hello and welcome to Profi. Profi is a knowledge management organisation platform that enables journals, funders and research centres to find experts to review and evaluate scientific manuscripts. Today I'm going to guide you through the Profi Referee Finder, helping you to quickly find experts to review a manuscript or proposal. We begin by going to the application, logging in and accessing the Referee Finding portal. We have two options, either to upload the PDF privately or to create it manually. I'm going to upload the PDF privately by clicking on there, then on drop file and then selecting the paper from the system. I will upload it and this can take a few minutes depending on how large the PDF is. Once it has uploaded, Profi will present you with the, the details of that manuscript. The first thing it will show is the authors identified in the paper. If it has identified them successfully and matched them to the Profi database, it will present them in blue. If it's identified them but not matched them, they will be in black. And if you don't see authors at all, it means it hasn't recognised them. If you are missing some authors or authors are in black, you can simply type their names in here and you can add them to the system. However, in this case, it has recognised all the authors. You can then check the title, the abstract and the full text that they are correct and simply save that file. Here is the overview of that file now and the home base of the referee finder. Here you have the title, the abstract, and the 184 concepts that have been extracted from that paper. There's also the references that have been passed by Profi that will be used in the referee finding process. Once you are happy, you can simply click on Find Referees, and then Profi will carry out analysis. You will then be presented with a table made up of various columns. The first column is the candidate referee's name, followed by any conflicts of interest that it has raised. For example, the house represents conflict of interest whereby the candidate referee has a common affiliation with one of the authors in the manuscript. A person head means that this, person, this candidate referee has co-authored a paper with one of their authors in the manuscript. And the paper clip simply means that the manuscript references this candidate referee. The second column is the gender of that, of that candidate of the referee. The, th the next column is the countries of affiliation, and then we come to the Profi score. This is the default ranking of the table. The Profi score is a cumulative ranking of scores across all relevant articles, such that is not normalized. The article score represents the score of the most relevant article, and then the articles is the number of relevant articles outside the brackets, and then the total number of articles uh, authored inside the brackets. As you can see, since the score is a cumulative ranking across all relevant articles, the higher this number is, the higher than this number is. So therefore, this can be slightly biased towards researchers with higher numbers, which I'll show you how to mitigate later. Then we have the total number of counts of papers with the author as lead, corresponding or senior author, and then the standard bibliometrics, including H-index, and the number of citations. If you want to learn more about the researcher, you can click on this arrow and we show the scientific concepts this, we, this candidate referee has in common and the most similar articles this candidate has in common. We also show affiliations and if you want to go even further, you can click on the candidate's name and it will take you to their profile. Now we go back and we can see that this, this table is presented is presenting many researchers and candidates with very high indexes who might not be in a position to make to referee the manuscript. We can therefore do some filtering. The first thing we can do is limit the analysis to top 10 articles. This will cap this number here at 10. This will therefore uh, increase and enhance the number of early stage researchers and to soften the number of candidates that are many articles in them. So if we apply this now, you'll quickly see this change. You can see now the number of articles being limited to 10, and we have a very different selection of people. We can also limit the analysis to the last five years, such that we only present candidate referees that have been active in the area recently. And we can start limiting in bibliometrics. So for example, we can limit by the number of the academic age, which is the number of years since the first publication. So for example, we can limit it to early stage researchers. And we can limit it, maybe have a, a lower H index cutoff. 
This once again will present a new list of candidate referees. You can then go on further and limit the analysis to maybe people that have only uh, own works, which is this leading senior author uh, or corresponding author. You can limit it to a certain type of institution and the gender if you want to increase diversity. You can then refine the referees based on specific concepts. And this comes back to what I mentioned earlier, which is how Profi has extracted 184 concepts of which vary from type. Here, if we click on this thing now, we see that Profi has clustered the scientific concepts into different areas. You can have theory, experiment, and statistics. And let's say, for example, we want to boost statistics and experiments, but we want to ignore theory. This way, you can completely control exactly the kind of referee you want to evaluate the manuscript. We can also filter referees by country or region, and we can also use author groups if you want to limit the analysis of the referees to a specific group of predefined people. This can be helpful if you're looking at having um, editor boards of editors that want to analyze that manuscripts. Finally, you can lim limit the uh, candidates to only those who have contact email addresses. Finally, if you are want to add in some names that are a part of your network or maybe it was suggested by the authors themselves, you can add in names here to see how they fare as part of the uh, analysis. You can see in this situation I've added David Harvey. Finally, you can then save the settings for future reference if you'd like to. Now, once you are happy with your, your table, you can start selecting referees. So for example, I want to select those that are not conflicts of interest, and then we can click them as mark as referee. This will hide them in green. If you're using Profi through a API integration, such as Editorial Manager, eJournal Press, or Manuscript Manager, this will send those authors back to the system. In this situation, it will simply highlight them, and then you can export those referees to Excel file for external use. That's an overview of the referee finder at Profi. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us. And I'm wishing you a happy day.